Hello, welcome to DCTT aka DAISY Config Tweak Tool Overview and Demonstration video. So you all must be wondering, what is DAISY Config Tweak Tool? It's a small application written purely in C-sharp that serves the purpose of helping DAISY players change their configuration settings, which some can be changed in-game, in a more user-friendly environment. How does it work? It works by loading up your settings files, daisy.cfg and profile name .daisy profile into itself allowing you to change values for each setting up to your liking, while at the same time providing you detailed explanation what each setting does and how will it help you in-game. After changing every setting up to your liking, you can simply press the save button and your new settings will be saved just like when you edit them manually. Why would you use it? Well, that's a simple one. It's much easier to open up a tool when you can immediately see all of the options that are important to you and your game from both config files instead of looking for them inside the configuration files. It's not just for those who don't know how to make their DayZ run better, it's also for those experienced ones to have a safer and an easier environment to do what they've learned to do manually. Where can I get it? You can download DCTT on a link shown on the screen or the description below directly or on the forum link to DayZ RP also located in the description below. Unfortunately, at the moment you can't download it from the official DAISY forum since the forum administrator decided to hide my thread from public viewing due to some random person reporting my thread for no real reason whatsoever, which Bone Boys, the administrator, explained in this reply. And now for the live demonstration. As you can see, the file is really small size, and when you run the tool you will see a small notice that I wrote, and when you close the notice you can actually see the main window. On this main window, you can actually see all the settings you can change and when you change it there will be a small message displaying what change that, that change does. Also if you hover over each settings you will see a message displaying how that affects your game and that of course works for every setting. Also you can choose one of the many themes, currently there is a 6 custom themes and when you try to save, when you're happy with your results you can save by pressing the save configuration files button and then you can choose whether you want to create a backup, overwrite a backup, and it will be all up to you. Also, if you run the older version of the application, from the settings menu you can download the newest available version, so you would be able to get the best experience out of this tool.